Hi, my name is Brett Shields. And I'm Ann Lang. And we are counselors here in the Wellness Center at Ohio Dominican University. And today we would just like to talk with you all a little bit about some self-care. And so today we are going to go through what we like to call the self-care alphabet. And so in the first letter of the alphabet, we like to use some aromatherapy as I have some aromatherapy lotion here today. And it can clear your mind and soothe and uplift you as you apply it. And for the next letter of the alphabet for B, I personally like to go biking as it gets me involved in the environment around and I kind of get moving and active. For C, you can create something. So whether that be creating some art, maybe a poem or maybe a picture or a painting, just creating something that is special to you. For D, you can declutter. So you can organize your room around you and kind of organize it how you would like your space to be. And for E, maybe you can eat something. So you can eat some of your favorite food or maybe something healthy like a banana or an apple. And those are just some of the first letters of the alphabet. And now I will turn it over to Anne as she continues with some other letters of the alphabet. Thanks, Brett. Another thing to remember when you are uh, engaging in self-care is make it something that you enjoy. Make it something that you like to do and takes your mind off of the drudgery of your daily life and COVID. We need something to enjoy during these times. Mm -hmm. um, I'm gonna skip through the alphabet a bit and go to R, which is reading. Find a good book. Find a book that you've been putting off reading for a while. Take some time and read something that you enjoy. Um, for S, service. If you take time to think outside of yourself, and it can be something as simple as baking cookies and taking them to a friend, um, making blankets or serving in a food bank. Mm. There are lots of opportunities out there and finding that thing that you enjoy doing and serving your community mm. or uh, friends in that way can be a real boost and give you energy to do other things that you need to do. Um, and I'll talk about one more, which is uh, to talk to your friends, make time to go on a walk with a friend or some other activity with a friend so that you have time to talk and just share what's going on in your lives. That time with a friend can give you energy to do the other things that you need to do. Absolutely. And you can make the alphabet your own as you kind of go through this self-care and create your own alphabet. And thank you.